You guys, we have more cats in this neighborhood than I can tell you. This is a cat that I've never seen before. The other two cats, um, one is black and white, another one is white and orange. Well, this is a new gray kitty that I've never seen before. Hey, kitty. Hey, kitty, what you doing? You chilling out on our porch? Hmm? The cats really seem to like our porch. I don't know why. <laughs> I guess it's peaceful, and sometimes they hide out underneath it. What you doing? Hmm? You being a kitty? Doing kitty stuff? Meowing? What are you meowing for? I don't have any food for you. I'm not going to feed you because you'll keep coming back. But you are a pretty kitty. Make sure you tell your friends to stay out of my garden, okay? See you later. Hello, YouTube family. Matt and I are on our way to somewhere. We're just kind of out and about. We're probably going to go over to Belmar. Which is a little shopping center area. I want to let you all know that I am not naked today. I do have a shirt on. It's just a strapless shirt. So if you see me talking at the camera today and you do not see any straps or sleeves, please be aware that I am fully clothed. I'm not living that kind of life, you guys. The naked life? The naked life. It's not a life I'm living. We're at Watson's Coffee and Tea over at the Belmont Shopping Center and Matt just got a coffee. He needs his caffeine intake for the day. And then I got a iced tea. It's called Cloud Catcher. It's really good. It has like a, I don't know, a peachy flavor. Someone did some sidewalk art. I don't know what the medium is. It looks like chalk to me, but it seems like chalk would go away very quickly. Could be like an oily chalk some kind of oily chalk or something. Yeah, and then there's also this one over here. <coughs> Here's more. And we found some pizza. That one's a little bit hard to see. Then we also got some uh, Campbell's condensed hot dog chili soup with the dog coming out of the top. Matt just told me some very interesting news about himself that I did not know. Yeah, I was just saying I didn't know the difference between a skirt and a dress when I met you. I never gave it any thought, so I just thought skirts were a type of dress. I'm shocked to hear that because he has two sisters and surely they wore skirts and or dresses growing up. No, it was you who clarified that to me. You're actually the one who taught me the difference. It seems kind of silly in retrospect, but I just never gave it any thought. I am glad I could help then. This reminds me of when I was little and I would hear my aunts and uncles and grandparents saying, Lord have mercy. And I never knew what they were saying, but like, you know, I got older and I realized they were saying, Lord have mercy. Mm -hmm. And then when that, I realized that it was like a cloud moved away. Mm -hmm. And so many things made sense to me, mm -hmm. like the context of the conversations and mm -hmm. things like that. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that's, I think, similar, yeah. I guess. Yeah, something becomes clear that was unclear before. You learn something new every day. I did not know that about you. Mm -hmm. You never told me that. Hmm. Hey guys, happy Monday. Hope you all are having wonderful Mondays wherever you're at. I have been home from work in downtown Denver for maybe, I don't know, two hours or so. And I just got off the phone with my mom. Hi mom, hi dad, hi Amber. Hope you all are doing good. And now I am trying, attempting to do some homework. Doing a little bit of reading for a class that I have tomorrow. And it's not going too good. Probably because I have my laptop open and I'm on YouTube. Why Why am I even doing that? Why would I even attempt to do homework and have my laptop open with YouTube on the webpage? So I should probably uh, close my laptop and get on this homework. And that's what I'm gonna try to do. Oh my goodness, y'all, these cats. I just caught this cat trying to go into my garden. I knocked on the window to get his attention, and now he's looking for me. He's like, what's going on? And now, good, it's going the other way. But it was headed straight into the backyard over to the garden. We really need to do something about these cats. They're cute. I like cats, but I don't like them in my backyard. Look what came in the mail today. We got a really special book, and it is called... 
When I Think About My Dad by Mimi Greider. It's all about this little boy Carlos who is super impressed with his dad and looks up to him. Here's just a really cute picture of their family right here. This book is special because it was illustrated by Matt's best friend and it was written by Matt's best friend's wife, Mimi Greider. And here is a picture of Mimi and her family on the back of the book. Matt's best friend isn't featured in the photo. It's just uh, his wife and his kids. On the back, Mimi wrote a description about why she wanted to write this book. And it says, It was brought to my attention by my children's Nina, their grandmother, that it is hard to find children's books with multiracial characters and families. I want my grandkids to read books with families that look like theirs, she said. As would any good mother, I wanted to solve the problem. I penned a book series that featured multiracial characters. My husband, a graphic artist, illustrated them. Although these books have multiracial characters, they are for all children. They are level one reading books that are imaginative and have good principles and values. Any child can enjoy and learn from them. And that's not the entire back. I only read a certain section of it. And then Mimi is planning on writing another book to add to the series called Aria. And believe it or not, this super cute family was based on me and Matt. We don't have a daughter yet, but it's just nice to see that. And I'm super impressed with the book. Um, the name of the book again is... When I Think About My Dad, and it's by Mimi Greider. We got ours off of Amazon.com. So definitely go check it out. It's an awesome book. I'm going to go ahead and call it a night and say good night to you all. Matt and I hope that you all had an excellent day. And we hope that you enjoyed our vlog. And we will see you next time on It's Threads. Good night.